Okay. But for this morning, beautiful weather, great conditions for traveling if you do have to take a road trip anywhere today. But of course, it is a very cold morning, starting off with chilly conditions. But we have sunshine, clear skies looking absolutely amazing outside. And of course, Saturday is just a nasty looking day, but we had nicer weather returning for your Sunday. And that's what we'll have for today and most of this week. Now, before I get into the rest of the forecast, quick shout out to Sharon. It was nice meeting you Saturday when we were volunteering at the Love Hills Clinic. Hopefully you're doing well today. Your family does well also. But now looking at your headline, so today will be a little bit warmer than yesterday. Not much, but we'll continue to warm up more so throughout this week and we'll have nice weather for a few days. Now here's a look at those current temperatures. 30 in Liberty, 36 in Denham Springs, 39 in Gonzales, and 32 in Woodville. So if you're about to leave home, of course that big coat is still needed. But with high pressure in place, that's helping us to have these beautiful weather conditions for yesterday and also for today. Now on Sunday, we reached a high temp of 59 degrees, but today will be in the low to mid 60s. So again, a slight warm up from today from yesterday into today, but we'll have plenty of sunshine lasting. If you have today off, just go ahead and sit outside. Enjoy the nice, gorgeous weather that we'll have on this Monday. Now, of course, this morning, still a little bit too cold to sit outside, but do that later this afternoon. And as we have that southerly wind flow returning, that's going to help our temperatures to rise more. So not only for today, but also over the next few days. So our overnight lows will be in the upper 30s to low 40s. We'll still have a cold Tuesday morning, but again, we'll pretty much all be above freezing versus this morning when we had some towns below freezing and then tomorrow's highs will be in the upper 60s to low 70s 72 for Denham Springs 70 for Gonzales and 69 for Woodville and then for your Tuesday all you need once we get past the morning hours just short sleeve shirts pants flip flops don't have to worry about needing a jacket or a coat by the time we reach the afternoon as will be in the low 70s but again high pressure will still be influencing our weather and then we'll have warmer air continuing to move in as we go through the rest of this week. Highs will be reaching the upper 70s on Wednesday and Thursday. Now we'll have a slight cool down on the way at the end of the week because another cold front will be moving through our area. Now as of now, it looks like most of the rain should stay north of our viewing area. If we if we receive any rain, it may only reach the northernmost section, but this will likely be sometime Thursday night into the early Friday morning hours. Then once that cold front moves through, we have the return of that northerly wind flow, bringing in that cooler air and drier air once again. So with the warm Warmer air and temperatures going up, dew points will be rising more so as well. Behind the passage of the cold front, dew points will be going back down to bring in that drier air, helping it to feel less humid as we close out this week. But just to recap what it looks at your seven day forecast, you can't ask for nicer weather than this as we'll be dealing with mostly sunny skies for the next few days. And then we'll pretty much be staying in the 70s for most of this week. But again, warmer days, warmest days of this week will be on Wednesday and Thursday with highs closer to 80. We'll be in the low to mid 70s for Friday through Sunday.